Hi, welcome to The Conscious Spirit. I'm Pam. I'm Mary Lynn. Together, we are TCS, TCS Everyday, Everyday Psychics. Psychics. And mediums, teachers. Yes. Healers. Healers. Of the multi-dimensional type. Yes. <laughs> the living, the non-living. Yes. Healed, unhealed. Yeah. 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 So, mm -hmm. all the way around. We're a little loopy, so we're just going to throw that out there. A little spirit spirit drunk or spirit yeah. high yes yeah. our um, vibration is super high yes we've um, been doing a lot yeah. of great um energy work today so um you've all seen us this way before yeah. yep. <laughs> the uh, screensaver on my laptop is you know um bubbles and when we sat down they were like in Hyper speed, yes. <laughs> which happens when our like, vibration is gets really high. Is this my eyes, or what's <laughs> happening here? Is that me? Is that who? Uh, yes, always a good indicator yes. that we have reached a good level. So <laughs> yes, yes. So okay, so mm. our uh, whatever dude sent us. Uh, Woo, see, I'm just really struggling to speak. <laughs> Hopefully this will get better. Our video guy. Yeah, thank you. He sent us um, a video. Uh, he says, watch the whole thing. I didn't do anything to it, although I'm not sending you the whole name. Yes. But it's a herb, Urbex Hill. Hill. Yes. Um, In a sanitarium. Sanatorium? Sanatorium. Sanatorium. Yeah. Okay. Sanatorium. All right. Um, yeah. And that's all he said. So Yeah. So he just uh yeah, yeah he transferred it on to whatever and did whatever. No, he, he didn't, he do didn't anything. take anything no. off. Okay. So this is that. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> I no. am so struggling here. <laughs> <laughs> and we didn't look into the we opened space, Open but space. we didn't which was already kind of open because we've been uh doing beautiful energy work all day. Um yep. and um yep. And so not really knowing um, too much about this, we didn't look into it. Right. So, um, and this is, sh the video that we're gonna watch is short, like yep. less than 20 minutes. Yes. So, and we have another video, this same person. Mm -hmm. So um, you'll probably see both of them on there. I think we're gonna put them out at the same time. So there'll be two shorter, shorter videos. Mm -hmm. um, so, so I'm hoping, I'm hoping this is like, jam-packed full yes, of stuff. Yes, yes. Looking forward to that. Yeah. So. All right. Should we, do, right. Should we do it? Yes. Okay. Let's do, 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 do. And, um, um, if you haven't already, yes. subscribe, yes. like, hit that notification bell. And share with your friends. Yes. Um, this is the ghost point of view. Um, if you have yeah. been around for a while, you already know this, but if this is your first time watching, um, yes, we are mediums. We are paranormal mediums uh, for over, I take the one up, uh, for over 20 years. And mm -hmm. this is what we do. We are, um, we clear space. We, um, we remove ghosts and entities, spirits, whatever, whatever verbiage you want to put on them, that's what we do. We remove them mm -hmm. and we clear space. So, um, yep, drawn yeah. the blank now. Yep. And so we're not ghost hunters, no. um, but we no. started watching the ghost hunting because there's so many misconceptions. Yes, yes. Um, we want to clear up some concepts yeah. and some belief systems that are out there that are just, I yeah. we don't understand. And so we thought what a great thing to do is give the ghost point of view. Yes. Um, and hopefully we will have some ghosts yes. um, in this one and we can tell you what they're, yes. you know, what they're going yes. through, uh, what they think about what's happening. Yes. And so, um, with that said, we are also, uh, we are teachers and we, are and teachers. we uh, yes. And this yeah. is part of what we, what we teach. Uh, we teach spiritual development and this is part of it. This is all under the spiritual umbrella. Um, Which is another misconception. Yes. Um, that the paranormal is somehow separate. Is not a spiritual thing, yeah. which is so not true. The paranormal is the ultimate of spirituality. Yes. In yep. you know. Um. Yep. So. All right. Yeah. 
I know. Sorry, we're a bit like yeah. kind of laggy and stuff, but like we've already explained all that. Um, but we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna do this. We're gonna do this. Give you the ghost point of view. Yep. And doing this should be much easier because we are in that vibration. Yes. So we should be able to tune in pretty yes. pretty well. And actually, so. when we first opened it. Um, again, we didn't like go looking for anything, but the energy was there and you immediately sort of got uh, oh, a little nausea. Yeah, yeah, the nausea. I, I was having a hard time breathing. Had to, had to ask my team to allow me to witness the energy without really feeling the energy. Yeah. Um, yeah. So yeah, the, the, the illness and the chaos. Um, yes. Yeah. Yeah. And the abuse. Oh, we'll definitely yeah. feel the abuse. Yeah. So, all right. So, all right. let's go ahead and let's start. Do oh, this. Yep. I'm gonna stop real quick. Um, I'm really getting a lot of uh, like hustle and bustle, uh, like uh, orderlies, nurses, etc., okay. moving around. I can hear this cart going, like the like maybe uh, they might have medicine on there, or maybe it's food, food carts or something. Or... I don't know. Okay, I can just see and um patients um some of them are kind of free to wander but others are not like there's locked doors you can see um uh some of them were like maybe even gated in or something okay because there's kind of that almost like a jail feel that type word that you know bars on the doors sure. that kind of thing um and I can see one nurse, like, just, like, I, I think she's, she's new. She's new and, like, not far out of nursing school, and she's really freaked out by all of it. Um, people are talking to themselves, they're yelling, um, they're, uh, some are sick. Uh, like physically sick some you know <clears throat> excuse me there's certainly mental illness there but there's also physical ill mm -hmm. uh illness so their health is in jeopardy etc and it's like she was placed there like at a nursing school or something <laughs> poor yeah. thing yes yes yeah. and like the other nurses aren't giving her a whole lot they're just kind of like a little bit of kind of like you feel like a little bit of laughter, like they're kind of laughing oh, at her, like she'll get used to it. Like, yeah. oh, it's her first time, they're kind of laughing. And then there's also bitterness. Oh. Like, uh, yeah. There's also some nurses that really, really care. Really care. I'm getting also nuns. So I'm wondering if there were some nuns that oh. uh, worked there as nurses could or be? something. Um, that could be. Yeah. Yeah, I, I wasn't picking up on any, like, staff, uh -huh. um, but definitely patients, like, 
what I was seeing, they were just milling around in the hallways. Yes, um, yes. And I'm gonna say, part of what I'm seeing is um, a psychic recollection of what was, and yep. Yep. some of what I'm seeing is residual energy. Um, I think a lot of mine is probably both the psychic mm -hmm. and the residual. Mm -hmm. Which is fascinating when that happens. Yes. Cause yes. it's like, it's yeah. like, you know how when you watch a movie with the, the 3D um, glasses yes. on? Do they still have to do that? I think they still make those. Do they? Yeah. Um, that but was always fun. When I see that, that's kind of how okay. it looks when I'm looking at sure. like different things. It's one like, out of the blue side, one out of the yep. red side. <laughs> it's so weird. <laughs> yes. Um, anyway, yeah, so, that's. Okay. That's what I'm getting so yes. far. Yes, and definitely this place is just going, just mm -hmm. all the vandalism and then just being old and um, unkept. Yeah. It's really kind of sad. It is. All right. It says, listen, you can hear footsteps again. Footsteps right above me, it says. Yeah, I can hear those. Do y'all hear that? Just walking. I hear footsteps. Yeah. I'm gonna stop. There's definite residual that could be making those footsteps. However, yeah. I think there's a guy up there. Yeah. I get masculine energy, not super masculine, but um, male, just male energy. Just, yeah. Like you, you pick up that it, it is, it was that lifetime he was male, that spirit yeah. was male. Yeah. Yeah. Absolutely. I get that too. Yeah. I cannot tell at this point how conscious. Yeah, I can't either. Of his surroundings he is. Um, hmm. Yes. Very mm -hmm. interesting. Yep. I got the same thing. Love it when that happens. I know. <laughs> okay. Um. Also, uh, like I just keep getting so much staff. Like there was, uh, uh, even people that just did paperwork or, you know, secretaries and that kind. Of, like there's a lot of, um, that's where some of the hustle and bustle comes from. So I'm adding that to my previous thing when I was talking about I feel all this hustle and bustle. I'm going to add that too. So that would add to the chaos. Yeah. Yeah. Of everybody. Okay. So what's what's coming for me is the big question of there was so much staffing. How could people have been so neglected? Yeah. Yes. Ugh. It was, yeah. it was hard for them to be in it yeah. and they checked out or whatever it was. Yeah. So I also get that there was like, maybe um, when people would come, like uh, there, there's a real feeling of sometimes they were sent there and other times like family would bring someone there. I don't know if these are like, there feels like they're separate parts of the sanatorium. Like someone couldn't handle this, their son or daughter anymore, or their father or mother or something like there was, and they could take them there. And they were very welcoming and smiley and oh, look how beautiful it is. And it looked clean and et cetera. But they weren't taken through the, like they didn't know, kind of like, don't look behind that door because right. you'll see the truth. The reality was not in the forefront yes. at all. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 So I'm wondering, I don't know when this was built. I don't know when it mm -hmm. was there, but if it was really, I'm guessing, um, just like it was before we had 
senior homes and uh, senior living and and that kind of and maybe not even senior living, more of the where they need more help like than that. Nursing home. Yes, type yes, that's and, what I was yeah. trying to get to. Yeah. Yeah. All right. All right. He replayed it, I think. Uh, listen closely, you can hear keys and a voice in the distance. <laughs> I just got this really creepy feeling. <laughs> okay. Um, it was like, um, it was like walking down the hall, like he was, and like somebody pushing up against me into the hallway um, or like into the into the wall and like somebody else like behind me pushing me and like hands on me yes um, like maybe like maybe forcibly making yes. me walk down this yes. hallway. Because what really uncomfortable. What I totally got before you said that. Um, so he said that he heard like keys jingling or whatever. And I got um, an orderly who was um, in the, uh, like I, I saw the orderly keys jangling, whatever. And he was rushing to help another orderly get someone moved. And that's what I thought. They, My thought is what that's what you picked up on. I think they had to lock this person in a they yeah. had to lock this person up. Yes. And that's they used to do that. Yeah. They thought it was really helping them, I think, by putting them like almost kind of like a padded room. Like they put them in there alone and they lock the door and right. they just let them let them be. Let them be. Because maybe they did something that they weren't supposed to. Yeah. Or they were getting angry or triggered or something. This is what's what I'm, I'm getting. Like it was a normal thing to do that, to put yeah, them in that's, a- Yeah, yep, a, that's just what they did. <laughs> yeah, like in isolation. Yeah, boy, how times have changed. Yes. Thank goodness. Yes, um, absolutely. So, yeah, trying to tap in to see, um, again, was this just psychically picking up on what had happened? I think, yeah. Yeah. Some of it could be residual, it, especially if he heard keys and right. the, so some of that is residual. I'm not getting um, an actual ghost there no. on that that particular orderly. Uh, but then that whole thing, I think, is just psychically you're just picking that up. We are yep. picking it up. Yep. Which it's crazy. A lot of that doesn't happen during these videos. No, <laughs> no, there's not. Believe it or not, there's not a lot of actual activity here mm -mm. thus far we haven't gone in that far we're sort of following along with him we're not spreading out we're not going out farther mm -hmm. we're walking with him and mm -hmm. that was sort of our intention um before coming it's like we're going to walk with with yeah. him interesting yeah. just that one dude upstairs i have not felt him though again no that that one guy that no we had heard those footsteps mm -mm. me either all right all right. Continue. Pay attention to the door, okay? Cool. 
It wasn't the wind because the wire would be moving if the wind was blowing. Okay. okay. So I guess it did come toward him a little bit, right? Is that what that was? Listen closely, you can hear keys and a voice in the distance. Hopefully this helps you when I read it. I'm confused. Okay, I'm gonna stop. So when we were walking, or when we were walking towards the door. Yeah, well, we were. I didn't see the door move. But when he turned around, had the door closed? Oh, I don't know. I thought I saw the, the door come toward him a little bit. <laughs> like open a little bit wider. Okay. Maybe he'll show it again. Maybe he will. Okay, okay. let's see. <laughs> Would that be the door right there? Um, I don't know. I could have swore or somebody. Oh well. Yeah. You think he would have alerted us to that had it? Yeah. Uh, I looked around, but I didn't see or hear anything else. That's weird. Oh, there's someone in there. Hold, hold up. Boop. Oh, missed it. I missed it. The, the room off to the right or that room that he was in? The one that he was in. Um, and it was just a, uh, let me see. I just caught a quick glimpse like that. Um, no, it's actually, it, it is uh, an earthy. Okay. Um, he's... I think he, uh, you see him in just like a, uh, almost like a hospital gown. And when I say almost, because it's, it doesn't like it's not fully open in the back, but it's like a hospital gown. Okay. You know what I mean? Yeah. 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 Okay. Um, so I don't have to see, you know, his crack or anything. Um, but he's just sort of. What, he was just watching him. He was just standing there and he was kind of rocking. He was standing and he was just watching the guy and he just walked right past him. But he is uh, not a lot of, even in life, mental capacity was, was diminished and now it's even further, but he still has some consciousness to him. Okay. I have, uh, can't open my eye. <laughs> oh, what is that? And my head. My head okay. hurts. Okay, I'm going to say that's him. Yeah. So I want you to go with okay. that. Yeah, because he's kind of leaning off to one side just like that. He even has kind of that look that you just had on your face. <laughs> yeah. It feels like they have him on some pretty heavy medication. L sedated, really yes. slow. Yes, yes, and yes. I don't know how else to say this. Very simple in his thinking. Yes. I'll take that. Yeah. That very, land. Very simple. Yep. 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 <sighs> so if we were there, he'd be a very, uh, um, he'd be easy to just yeah. cross over without, without a doubt. Um, yeah. Yeah. Because he, he, he really isn't, he doesn't know that he's dead. Um, yeah, I could agree with that. Yeah. Um, and I don't think it would take a whole lot other than no. to just simply yeah. tell him what, yeah. it, you know, you have the so option of. What I really get, yes. Yeah. And what I get is that he was, they didn't like something about what he did. I don't get a lot of anger, but there was something that he did. Like he had a lot of energy, he was super talkative, he was something, and so they sort of medicated him just to, so they didn't, they had so many patients to deal with. I hate to go to the place where they were, I think they, there were some abusive uh, employees there, but they just sort of medicated him so they didn't have to, to do so much with him, is what I get. Yeah. And that's kind of like, you almost feel like a twitch, don't you? Like there's like, yeah, there's, yeah. Um, that real talkative, um, he just wanted connection. And so he yes. would just 
talk yeah. to anybody. Yeah. Um, and even his speech was slow, so it took him a while to even yes. get a sentence out. And they're like, oh, my God. Yes. I got work to do. Yes. So, And yeah, he, that... he was a, uh, uh, what did Seinfeld call it? A close talker. Like, he'd come right up when he was talking. Like, mm -hmm. to, you know, to, to talk. Which leans to that connection. Cause yes, yes. The and closer he just didn't he know get how to, to get somebody. Yeah. 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 Like, yeah. he didn't have family, a lot of friends, whatever. And he just wanted to have a connection. Yeah. And it just got on someone's nerves. And they over-medicated him to sort of, or whatever medicated oh. him, to sort of um, hush him. Uh, I think that's how he died. I think, Ooh. Oh my God, my heart is just racing like it was an overdose. Yeah. But I don't think it is, was intentional. No. But they... Okay. And I'm feeling in my throat like I'm having a hard time breathing. <gasps> like I'm <gasps> trying to gasp for it. Oh, Ooh. okay. I'm lightheaded. Super yes. lightheaded. Yes. Okay, so the, what I'm getting yeah. is they started medicating him. He adapted so they up to they sure sure oh, more more and i think more. something different they introduced something different additional maybe and the combination oh Ooh, okay like multiple people were giving him yeah drugs but they they didn't the interaction was not good because i'm seeing different shaped pills yeah which is telling me right it was different types of medication yeah yeah but that came toward the end because they didn't know what to do because like you said, he yep. sort of adapted and you become adapted to that. Yeah. Yeah. And, uh, yeah. and they try to Which happens else. in addiction. Wow. And I can feel myself like I'm trying to. Talk. I, I like want to yes. talk so fast. Yes. I just like want to move it. Yes. And that's what he was trying to do. He was trying to talk and he was trying yeah. to communicate, but he couldn't because they had him on shit. Yeah. And, the, and eventually they overdosed him. Yeah. 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 And, the, and he doesn't yeah. know. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. That's really sad. That is very sad. I'm yeah. exhausted. I know. <laughs> that was exhausting being him. Could it you was. be that every day? Oh, wow. And there's a feeling of his mind still, so it really affected him physically, but his mind, he, he thought he was talking. Yeah. But it was like a, it come out in a mumble or whatever, and people, they didn't understand, you know, he wasn't understood and they didn't want to understand him. Yeah. Ugh. Uh, okay. So sad. Yes. Good. Um, good catch. But he wanders. He doesn't just stay in that room. By the way. Okay. Now you can feel that is one. not the same nope. guy that nope. we. Nope. Okay. Yeah. I didn't nope. think so. I'm not getting that anyway. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Definitely some uh, like shadow people-ish or just dark balls of energy moving around down there. Okay. I kept right there at the end, um, I kept getting a nurse. Ah. Um, yeah, I don't know if she was conscious or residual. No doubt. Yeah. I definitely heard something that time. And where is the place in tunnel? I wonder what fuck. that. Yeah. 
some not good stuff happen down in these no, tunnels. No, I agreed. And the claustrophobia is getting me. I'm trying to like uh -huh. you know, open up, open up, open up, open up. Ooh. I kept hearing something ahead of me, but I can't really hear it on camera. This tunnel in front of me is where something. <laughs> I didn't see it in time to read it. Oh, there's an apparition. Oh. Hey. Okay. <gasps> I bet that was in the title. I bet so. <laughs> I decided to leave after this. And what the f is that? Yo, do you see that shit? Yo. Sorry for moving the camera so much. <laughs> oh, he's trying to get out his oh. weapon in case he's attacked. Oh, now I see something. Uh -huh. I did it at first. Can I move this up? That glare. That is crazy. There's somebody down here. It's an, it's a. Oh shit. There's somebody down here. I get. I swear I saw somebody. What the. Oh, okay, I'm getting mixed messages here. Let's. Keep watching. It kind of feels to me like it's an orderly. Well, that's what I wanted to say. And then I got doctor. Okay. So I don't know what that means. There was definitely a, a, a figure there. Definitely a spirit. I'm gonna I'm gonna say definitely a ghost. Yes. Yeah. Definitely an earthy. Oh my god. What? What the fuck? What? Now that is why he's there, right? Right, yes. Okay, just make it sure. And you should probably never go these places alone just in case you get trapped or something. Yeah. And what if that had been a person? Yeah. A dangerous person. Yeah. I saw somebody walking. So I do want to say something about that. So let's say it was a person and he yeah. went down and he has his his firearm I'm assuming is his weapon I guess yeah um and let's say he was attacked or something and he would be he would have to use his weapon um I I I get that I get while he carries it I am told I full disclosure yeah. I'm a two-way person um so I I I get that, but how sad ha if he had to use that shooting someone, even killing someone, especially killing someone, mm -hmm. that is not something you want to live with. No. That is not at all something you'd want to live with, having to have shot someone. Yeah. yeah. And if he were al not alone, if he had someone else with him, the odds of not having to use that weapon yes. are increased yes. exponentially. Yes. Um, and then, and I go to, what if I'm overpowered and yes. my weapon is taken away yes. and used on me? Right. Yes. Um, Someone, because, and, and here's, part of it is, 
if there was someone there, that someone probably knows that area really, really well, mm -hmm. and I don't. Right. I don't know what's around. I don't know my surroundings or anything right. like that. So yeah. um, you'd really better, you'd be much better served going with a friend or, a, you know, some sort of partner. Or a group. Or and, <laughs> and, if you, if, and if you want to carry, carry. But right. when Absolutely. you're with someone, there'd and, be less like feeling of having to pull my weapon. Right. And this isn't about the weapon. No. no this no. is about going and doing stuff like yes. this alone. Yes. Um, yes. And alone is just never the safest. No. Not to something like this. Like when he, well, even uh, the the one we watched before this, which we'll also put up, is in a church, right? Right. And um, so, yeah, it's just, and there could be. Um, yeah. Yeah. You, anyway. You just never know what you're going to come across. No. Uh, and having more people is just yes. safer. And that was a ghost you saw. <laughs> that was a ghost you saw. <laughs> yeah. So I got, I got orderly as well. And you said orderly. Yeah. And then I got doctor. So I was like, what is that? And there was a thought that the orderly... Was he going to be in trouble if he got caught by this doctor or was the doctor doing something nefarious down, you know, something. So what I got was he was an orderly and he was up to something. Did he impersonate as a doctor? <gasps> Ooh. Or did they allow him to? Because they needed. Oh, they needed the help, the extra help or something. Because what we do know it is just part of history is these places were often understaffed. They had a lot of staff. A lot of staff. But it was still understaffed compared to how many patients. Mm -hmm. And so. And the type of staffing they needed. Yes, was not. Was. No. Yeah. Oh, so. Mm, orderly, doctor. Do you get anything more? Nope. In that? Nope. And I don't think the doctor. I. There was some, it's just the one guy, mm -hmm. and I got those two things. Yeah, maybe I'll get more. I don't, I kind of yeah, no. threw me out because I was mm -hmm. watching really in 3D, watching him walk down the hall and then uh -huh. the, the figure and everything. So there was a lot going on. It is, and it's different when you see an apparition um, because the human takes over. Yeah. Um, yeah. Mm -hmm. So, okay. All right. Let's continue. Okay. So, okay. Oh, they're just showing this again. Okay. Or no, is he walk oh, he's, he's walking he's out leading? now? And that is way too oh, narrow for my yeah. self. Yeah. Uh uh. The claustrophobia. No. Like the grids are totally what screwed up. I'm not. I'm really not feeling a lot of that. Mm. Oh, they're gonna show it now. Is when they're showing again. What the fuck? There. Wow. No. Yeah. What? No. What the There's a feeling that he's really walking, he's but not like... going anywhere. <laughs> yeah. But it's like right, right. Yeah. Like walking in place. There's somebody down here. <laughs> oh, shit. Yeah, that was good. That was. <laughs> that was good. Another reason to what take a friend. Y'all will not believe this. My f light died. Nah, this is some bullshit. Mm. Using a f cell phone light. 
So he had to stand there in the dark. Yeah. Oh, no. Not even a little. No. Because you're standing in a building of activity? What the fuck? How does that make sense? The shit was all the way charged. Yeah. And he's he's freaked out. Yes. His vibration. His energy. I'm stop. Okay. His energy level might be high mm -hmm. with the anxiety, but his vibration is low. You know, low. that's something that you never hear them talk about that that we have touched on but haven't actually spoken i don't think out loud is they talk about oh the the batteries were drained because there was activity etc mm -hmm. which is true right however we can do it too our vibration can drain our own instrument mm -hmm. happens all the time we'll be on um on mm -hmm. the phone doing whatever and the phone goes it disconnects um we're on skype and it gone yep. yep so i mean that kind of stuff happens all the time will be after we do like a major healing on someone or something um i might grab my phone and i can't even use it like my hand it won't let me do won't anything register. No. so that happens all the time and sometimes it's our own so part of this could be him could as be. well yeah so great point and i'm so glad you brought that up because we wanted to say something and we just kind of forget or whatever so um, and oh this doesn't have as much, uh, there, there is activity there. Certain, mm -hmm. you can feel there's, there's a lot of, there's some energy. There's, there are more spirits, more ghosts than we've pointed out. We kind of you get a feel that they're there, but we, at least I have not said much. I assume you're the same. Yeah. I think this is a fairly large yeah. place. Yeah. Um, and I do get the feeling that throughout there yes. are. And I think that's why you don't feel the real condensed energy in one space because, mm -hmm. uh, like we've talked about in other videos, they're like balloons, right? And you walk through and it spreads. The mm -hmm. energy just spreads. And that's what happens here. Yeah. There are some shadow people, though. Um, but. Nothing, I have not once felt threatened. No, not at all. Yeah, which I'm super surprised about. Mm -hmm. Although, possibly somewhere else in there, maybe there is that kind of activity. We're just following with him. Yeah. So we're not, um, yeah, so very interesting. Yeah. Okay. All right. Just charge this battery pack. Excuse my language. What the? Okay, I have to say something. Yeah. There was a time when Marilyn and I would go into. It's really dark and the lights are off and everything. We do all that because the the uh, sensory perception, the whatever you know. Yeah. Anyway, the hell. And finally, one day, I think we had the thought the same time we went. Why do we can see? Why do we need to turn the like we we can see the spirits? Why are we turning the lights off? Why are we why are we scaring ourselves in the dark? This is just ridiculous. And so we and so we just stopped. It's like okay, yeah. Well, <laughs> so fun. It's like what are we doing? We don't need to have all the lights off. Um, there are times when you can't help it like I assume this is so far back into the place or whatever right. like sometimes that's just the way it is but purposefully we don't have to to do that no. you know so and there are occasions where there's 
so much stuff. Yes, yes. That we turn them off. Yes. To kind of, you know, dull yes. the visual. So if we go into a home where it may not be hoarding, but they have way too much stuff and that would be a nice time to like cut or skin turn yeah. that off because yeah. it gets in the way. It just gets in the way. So anyway, but I just I, thought that was funny. Actually, I had actually <laughs> forgotten about when we Why are why? <laughs> why I know. What are we doing? Because you just yeah. 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 Walking around in a strange place, especially a big place like that yeah. in the dark. Yeah. That is not the same if you're in a home, someone's home and you know it's dark but in a place like that yeah yeah no okay so funny All right. let's keep going <laughs> <laughs> I'm looking at the camera screen just to see. I cannot find my way out. <sighs> that felt like a cafeteria or something. I could buy that. Stupid yeah. as hell. That's why I smell French fries. <laughs> <laughs> or you're hungry, whichever. That's not the way I came home. I think this house down here. This is ridiculous. Never explore <laughs> without multiple battery packs, y'all. Oh, oh. oh, I thought he was going to say people. You all hear that noise behind me? In today's video, I'm continuing my exploration of Molly Stark Sanitarium, a tuberculosis hospital. Who he saw on the balcony was a person. It was my first thing. Um, but uh, anyway. Living so, person. Yes, 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 yes. 3D person. But I don't know. And I'm, I'm, if you can feel into it if you want. I sort of, as soon as I knew that the video was almost over, I started coming back out. So. Yeah, uh, I, I don't know. Yeah. Could be a spirit. There are a lot of them in there. Lots of them in there. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So, um, she did look pretty solid. Yeah. Um, but yeah. 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 Well, this was a great video. Thank you yeah. for suggesting it. Whoever, um, suggested and, um, go ahead and subscribe if you haven't already. Yes. Subscribe. Like. Cause yes. we love our subscribers. Yes, you guys we are do. great. We do. Yes. Yeah. And, uh, that was, that was, um, that was really good. That was good. That was yeah. fun. Yes. Mm. I'm really excited about this one. Yeah. Yeah. And I'm excited to hear, you know, what, um, what our viewers have to say about it. Yeah. I, I gotta say, so the, the footsteps where we heard uh -huh. the man upstairs, I'm a little disappointed. I never felt him again. Agreed. Cause yeah. I was really kind of wanting to, yeah. um, yes, I could have gone searching for him. Um, but I don't think he wanted to be found. Correct. Um, I will absolutely agree with that. Yeah. Yeah. So, so yeah. Yeah. Oh, well. 
Yeah. But we got to see an apparition. That we was do. Cool. That was awesome. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. And um, just so you all know, I, I know that, uh, well, we haven't been able to to really get back to a lot of the comments and everything mm. um, like we used to. We have been really Ooh. busy. It's, um, this yes. business is feast or famine, I think. And uh, we are feasting. We are feasting. Yes. Um, along with, you know, me being a grandma, which yeah. I know I talk about all the time. But life has been really busy for both of us. So um, we, we'll, we'll give comment to some, but we don't get to them all anymore. And I apologize yeah. if you get it left out. Please know it's it's really not on purpose. It just, it just, yeah. It it just is. But yeah. we do appreciate your comments. Yes, we do very um, much. We are trying to stay up on our emails. Um, yes. The emails have to take precedence. Yes. Um, over yes. The, over the comments. Yes. And we really have. The list of videos is so long, um, and we appreciate that you all want to give us, um, you know, suggestions and everything. We at this moment we really don't need any more. Yeah. Um. I, and 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 I hate to say that because you guys are so fabulous, and I know you want us to look at them, but yeah, it's just it. We're we're almost. Almost overwhelmed. Almost yeah. overwhelmed. I'm glad that there are multiple requests for the same video. Otherwise, we'd never get through them yes, in a yes, lifetime. Yes, yes, yes. Yeah, <laughs> absolutely. Yeah. So, so, but we appreciate you all. We, we do. We really, really do. We yes. really do. Um, we're really excited for where this journey is taking yes. us. And again, this summer, new stuff <laughs> coming. Yes. Maybe not even quite. Well, we're almost well, in the summer. I don't know when summer starts even. Yeah. So, yeah. you know. Well, May, June, something like that. Yeah. May. But yeah. We'll see. Okay. Yes. Maybe some teachy stuff Stay coming tuned. up. Yes. Yeah. All right. Thank you so much. And Thank hope you, you enjoyed this video. We hope so. See and we'll you next see you time. next time. Bye. Bye.